All right, ISO RDL <coughs> or isometric Romanian deadlifts um, is in this phase, and I put in, uh, put in I believe there's two um, isometric exercises in this. Um, the reason why those are implemented in this phase is because with an isometric contraction, you produce as much force as you can against an object that doesn't move. So for you to try to do something that is obviously way too heavy, you have to recruit more fibers, more fibers, more strength and power to your muscles. So that's what we're trying to do here. We're trying to recruit as much as we can um, in this pattern. The second thing too is because we're actually putting your body just under stress, there's no damage done to the joints or no added stress uh, for no reason. As you're aging, that's something we're trying to obviously uh, keep in mind. So um, I just want you here is all you do is you're gonna hold on. I believe this one is uh, a full 10 seconds old hold. Uh, so you're going to hold for 10 seconds. You want to make sure that during that 10 seconds you're contracting and squeezing everything as hard as you can. Um, you kind of have to be focused and aware of what you're doing to maximize the recruiting of the fibers. If not, uh, you don't get as much out of it. It's still going to work, but you might get as much as you can. So be aware of what you're trying to achieve. In this case, we're trying to get your hamstring, your upper back, well, basically your posterior chain, which is the back of your body, so the entire back, your hamstring. Um, you're going to get your toes too because they're going to be digging into the ground your grip, everything's going to be involved. So it's almost a full body workout. Obviously the chest is not as involved or your quads, but there's still going to be someone involved in that um, exercise. So all you're going to do is find something that's stable. You can use potters or holders. This might as long as you have something to brace on. Uh, sometimes it's ideal to put weight on the platform. If not, not a big deal. Okay. All you're trying to do is basically contract everything as much as you can. So, you grab the bar, again, you have to RDLs, so we're going to get more of a straight leg. You're going to make sure everything is side slow. And all you're going to do is you're going to pull as hard as you can. You're going to hold it for a full 10 seconds. And then you're going to release for 10. Um, take the break. Uh, there's a side break, so you don't need to. In this case, it's more so go back whenever you're ready. If you feel like you're good to go, just go back at it. If you're not, take your time, okay? Uh, but keep in mind, again, that central nervous system takes more time to recover. And since we are still targeting it, we want to make sure we get a good recovery. Um, but if you feel like you're ready after a little minute, go back. Uh, as you're going down though, towards that sixth, fifth to sixth rep, you might need more break, that's fine too.